is up you guys welcome back to my channel today we are going to be unboxing a figure that arrived before i had to move out but i was like still in the process of moving out so i couldn't unbox it and record um a video for it because some, i was packing my figures okay but this is one that i've been so excited to unbox just because i have another figure that goes with this figure and it is the radio e eva part two kaoru figure uh this is a i think it's a yeah it's a one seven scale figure and y'all i have the asuka figure and i cannot tell you i mean you can go watch the unboxing video of that because <laughs> i think you'll be able to see the excitement in my face and in my voice and in my expressions when i unboxed that figure i was so ecstatic and i remember mentioning i think that i couldn't wait for this one to come out so it's finally out i finally have it and i can finally unbox it you don't know how hard it was not just like grabbing the box and ripping it open and unboxing him so we can finally unbox him so we're going to be doing that today uh please make sure you like and subscribe and follow me on instagram um to see my entire or to see more of my collection and maybe you'll catch a photo of him on there soon so the reason why i loved the asuka so much is not only because they like nailed the face and it literally looks like asuka from the series but the amount of details and like the clothing like she had this fur coat or something and you can like see the texture of the actual um material oh it was so good. The details are just phenomenal. So I'm hoping that Kaoru's is just, is just as good or maybe even better if it can be better. <laughs> also, I don't know if I mentioned this for the Asuka one, but I love how the text is, has that like rainbow effect. I think it's so cool. But anyways, this is what the figure is supposed to look like. Um, here we go. I initially had Shinji pre-ordered, but after a while I kind of fell out of love with him. I just don't, I didn't like the outfit. I didn't like the long jacket on him. I think like compared to everybody else, him and uh, Rei were my least favorite for Rei. And I didn't like the lace on the bottom of her jacket or coat or whatever she was wearing. I think it was a coat. So I canceled her and Shinji, but anyways. Here he is. Here is Kaoru. Now, without saying too much, let me go ahead and put him on his base. So here's his base. It says Radio Eva meeting new quality via Evangelion at the bottom. Okay, so here he is on his base. He sits very snug in there. It's a little bit hard to like actually fit him onto the base all the way. Like you're gonna have to put him on like a hard surface surface and push a little bit down but again that's only because he's supposed to be um he's supposed to fit in there very snug just like asuka i remember asuka's being a little bit tricky where you had to push down a little bit and it could be a little bit scary especially for like people who manhandle everything like me um but it it, it fits in there snug it's really just be careful <laughs> but here he is okay so first things first I love the outfit so much and I think a lot of people, some people like didn't like the outfit. I think this fits Kaoru very well. Like he looks so neat in this outfit. He looks so cool. I love this walking pose. It's like this very confident but also like carefree walk and stance like with his head held up high and then he's got his like arm swinging back and you know the jacket's kind of like falling off shoulder very cool the detailing in his t-shirt is so sick like the actual print is insane i am so impressed with the design like all these lines and it's like i think it's like looking up from the I want to say it's the, uh, the Tokyo Tower, the Red Tower. They got all the details of the structure on there. Like, it is 
so impressive and again they nailed it with the jacket so like i said i was so ecstatic and so excited about the detailing in asuka's jacket kaoru's jacket is a bit similar but i think it has like less detailing than asuka's it might be because kaoru's is a black jacket and asuka's is like a beige or tan jacket so that that's probably why it looks like it's less detailing because the shading i think in black is a little harder but it is very much there and i think it's so cool uh, another thing that I'm like really excited about and really happy about and I think is so cute Kaoru's like little star earrings I think they're so cool I love that so much the earrings suit him so well and I love his smile I just love his overall expression the hair again just like Asuka's is is sculpted so well and it flows so nicely and I think it's shaded so well as it's so good so good what a great figure I am digging this Radio Eva series also digging the ripped jeans and the cool shoes they never fail on the shoes at least with these two characters i have seen some of the shoes where like i was gonna say shinji was wearing clogs they are not clogs but they are just these like regular like i think they're like slip on shoes that i wasn't really impressed with i think i think it was a radio eva figure where he was wearing that but the sneakers are always a win like with kaoru and i did like asuka's better but still um kaoru's is still so cool and i think it goes with his outfit so well too he looks looks fantastic and he looks very much like his anime design and I am so happy about that and I've been so excited not only to get like a Radio Eva Kaudu figure but just a Kaudu figure in general or like scale figure in general I freaking love Kaudu so much you guys have no clue um I wish he got like a hundred times more screen time than he actually did in the series I know he did get like a good amount but for him being one of my favorites and comparing how much screen time he got with everyone else of course it was you know it was because of like the plot and the story that he couldn't but I really do wish he got more screen time <laughs> Anyways, I also really love the like green and purple accents on him uh, as well. And then these like little loops at the end of his jackets, just like, oh my God, he's gonna look so cool next to Asuka's. Okay, so here are the two together. And I love that I took Asuka out of her place to display her next to Kaoru because it's now reminding me of how much I absolutely love the Asuka figure so much. I still do think that the Asuka one is better. I think because th there's more you can do with Asuka, like especially her hair. I think it's her hair that's like really standing out to me more than Kaoru. So it's nothing, nothing personal towards Kaoru, but I think because of Asuka's hair and like the waviness and the wind, like she, she wins. <laughs> but them together they look so cool like imagine the whole set together i know i canceled chinji and Rei, and i don't, really still don't plan on getting them but imagine like having a full complete radio eva set my goal is to eventually get like a complete radio eva set obviously it's not going to be this one but um in the future hopefully i'm like <laughs> in love with all of them enough where I can get all of them and like stick to my pre-order. I am absolutely in love with these figures. What a great figure to unbox when I move out and like reset up my stuff. Like it would suck to unbox a figure after I moved out and, and haven't unboxed anything in so long and like hate it. But anyways, that was the Hobby Max 17 scale Radio Eva Kaudu figure. Please let me know what you think in the comment section below and I will see you in the next one which is hopefully hopefully soon. Bye bye guys.